Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can extract data from a broken phone. So this works for Android and iPhone. So if you're broken your screen, then you are actually still able to get that data out of your phone. So if it's really important, it might be worth it to try to get it out. It's not that easy, but there are some things you can do to extract that data and still use it and save it on your PC, for example. Of course, this only works if, for example, you smashed your screen and you can't see anything anymore, but the phone itself is still working. So if the phone's not working at all, if it's not able to turn on, then this won't be possible. This is only possible if the exterior of the phone is broken, so you can't access it, but it still starts up. So you will need to buy a cable that has the plugin for the phone, the correct plugin, depending on Android or iOS. And then on the other side, you need a HDMI connector. So that way you can plug it into a HDMI port on your screen. So on your monitor or on your TV, for example, you can then plug this in and then you're able to see everything you would, you're not able to see on the phone because the screen is broken, for example. And then you can see that on the monitor or sc TV screen. Next, you will probably need a keyboard and a mouse because you're phone is probably not working you can't touch anything so you can't type so you'll need to be able to get that so to connect all these things to the same phone you'll need to get a phone connector with the right port for your phone that has a lot of plugins you need one for HDMI so you can plug it into your monitor or display port if your monitor is a newer monitor you might need a display port cable check that first on your monitor then you'll need something to plug in your keyboard and your mouse, so two USB ports. So make sure you have to get a pretty long cable. So it's not that easy, like I said, but if you have really important data on your phone and you really need to get it back, then this might be worth it. So make sure you get a cable that you can plug into a screen and then connect your mouse and keyboard. And that's how you can then extract all the data from your phone. If you have any more questions, just comment down below and make sure to drop a like and subscribe if this helped you.